Hello, my name is Lucinda. I am a hiking guide and I have been asked the same question more than five times in the last day. And so I've decided to answer it for all of you using YouTube video. Um, the question is, what do I wear on my feet for winter hiking or snowshoeing? Really good question. I'm gonna show you some of my favorites. Um, and I kind of stick with Keen. And so it's up to you if you want to do a different brand, but you just want to make sure you're looking for a few things when you're looking for a winter winter hiking boot or for snowshoeing. So I'll show you my favorite first. This is what I wore last year um, and this year. So I wore this as my everyday winter boot, but it also is really good for hiking. And there's a few reasons why. Really good arch support. Mm. Yes, uh, snowshoeing. It has these cool little things on the back for your hooking your snowshoe on and it's not gonna wreck it and stays nice and sturdy. Sometimes they wear out back there if you have a snowshoe hooked on. Same with the toe, it's nice and sturdy. You're gonna hit any rocks or anything. Um, it's gonna be nice and sturdy. So that one is fantastic. This one is waterproof. It has this nice warm stuff inside and it's rated for minus 32. Or it is my everyday boot, and you can totally do that. Same with hiking, same with snowshoeing. My new ones I got this year, they're keen as well. They are the Greta. So I got them because they're a little higher, and I think that they're a little warmer. So they're a little softer on the inside um, and going to be a little bit warmer. They both stay rated to minus 32, but time will tell. I will let you know how that works out. I've taken these out for a spin, walk two or three kilometers, really comfortable, really good tread. Oh, they're a little dirty on the bottom. Uh, really good tread, uh, really comfortable and a little bit higher. So I usually wear gaiters, um, which is going to be up higher almost to my knee to keep me um, dry and to make sure that no snow goes down in the boot. So when you're in deeper snow, you want to make sure that um, and the gaiters help or like uh, I have some pants that are like not quite as heavy as snow pants. So that helps as well. Um, so those are the first two. Now there's other options and I'm gonna show you, my son got some. These aren't necessarily great for a long walk, but for snowshoeing or a short hike, these are huge, holy cow, my son has big feet. Anyways, we got those from Mark's Work Warehouse um, and they're the Heat T-Max. Um, and on the bottom, they have studs in them. So they have like little metal studs for um, traction. They're called Tarantula Ice FX. So that was from Mark's Work Warehouse. Um, fantastic, might not be the best for a longer hike. You want um, a little bit more comfortable of a boot. Here's a little something that I don't want you to wear. I forget the name of the brand, but people have asked me about these before and they're really popular, super cute. I'm not judging, wear them around town. Um, and my daughter has a pair like this. They're fluffy, they're suede, they're not waterproof. Um, there's no arch support. So on something like that, I would strongly recommend not wearing hiking or snowshoeing. Um, it's really, uh, not going to have any support and not going to be waterproof. So something like this is going to get soggy and it's going to get wrecked, especially suede. It's going to wreck with um, any water, snow, that sort of thing. Not going to keep you warm, not going to keep you dry, um, and certainly not going to have the arch support that you need. So these are like, we wear them as slippers around the house. So wear them around town, wear them as slippers. Don't wear them out hiking or snowshoeing. So that's my opinion and there's lots of brands out there. There's really good brands like Merrill and I know I've had great luck of finding um, a boot that was good for walking and everyday use at Mark's. Mark's does have some good stuff um, and they also have that good traction. I think it's that Tarantula um, brand that has some really good traction so you're not going to slip and fall because you want something there you're not going to fall. You're going to keep your foot warm and it's going to be comfortable to walk in. So that's my opinion about uh, winter footwear and uh, find something that works for you. I, a lot of people ask me about footwear and what brand is best. What brand is best is the one that's going to be comfortable on your foot. Um, just don't get anything too frou-frou. Uh, I hope that you're coming out. We're going to go snowshoeing. Uh, I've got all sorts of winter adventures coming up and I'm so excited about it. Um, but hopefully we get some stuff that keeps your feet warm and are comfortable. Take care.